Hello! In this lesson, we're going to talk about the footnotes and abbreviations. So first of all, I have to uh, paste a part of a text that I have previously typed in Microsoft Word. So I copy the text and paste it in Microsoft Word. As I paste, you see that I have HVDC, an abbreviation here. HVDC is the abbreviation of high voltage direct current. I have two ways to explain this abbreviation. First is to explain it inside the text, in front of the abbreviation, inside parentheses, or you can use footnotes that is uh, simpler and easier and more common. So first of all, I click after my abbreviation, go to references, and in the references, insert footnote is clicked. And you see that the footnote appears at the end of the page and number one automatically appears. So now you just need to uh, copy and paste the explanation related to your abbreviation. Let's practice more. I again uh, choose another part of the text that has another abbreviation and paste it in my text here. Here, as you see, we have F-A-C-T-S, facts, that is again abbreviation, and I want to make explanations about it. So I uh, go to references again, insert footnote, or you can um, click here, as you see, footnote and end note appears. So the window that appears uh, in this, we can choose the location of the footnote bottom of the page or uh, end of the page or uh, end note as well or what about the columns you can choose it in column one column two which column you want to locate your footnote I put it in column one number of the format uh, can be Latin words Greek words they can be numbers or uh, whatever you want and uh, it can start from number one or each number that you want. And numbering can be continuous. It can restart in each section or it can restart in each page that I put it on continuous for. And you can apply changes for this section or whole of the document. Uh, and then after you set every change you insert of course you apply first and if you click on the page again you see that all of the changes are applied so you insert it and you see that automatically number two is appeared at the end of your page as a footnote so i make any explanation in front of number two and you see that we can add more footnotes here and these footnotes are very important to make your text uh, more clean, simpler and more comprehensive. Thank you. Goodbye.